What time is it? It's Samsung Games time. We're gonna continue with our let's play of Generals and Rulers. Now, we have quite a bit of rebels, but look at how big we are. Like, we used to be this tiny thing, and now Kingdom of Jerusalem is on the map. And we're big on the map. Now, it seems like the Gyro Dynasty wants to fight us. However, they have 8 million people, so I'm slightly worried about going at them. I mean, to be fair, oh, Mongol Empire, look at that. Wow, big boys. But the, that's actually not bad. They're fighting with the Mongol Empire, so they could be weak. Let's let them spy at them, because it's it's fun times, right? Korea Dynasty. Oh, look at them. But their army is only two and a half stars, and units power is two and a half stars as well. They have some really good generals. They have 4,000 militia, I don't care. 1,000 trebuchets, 2,000 cavalry. I mean, it, oh, they have, they have 390 secret police. How many secret police do I have? Yeah, okay. Uh, we need more secret police if we're gonna go at them. Okay, so we who are we fighting? Or who do we want to fight? I want to keep destroying the Ivo dynasty because it's already been kind of on the way. So so where do I have my men right now? We gotta check that first. So we still have a men at the Empire of Nika and the Sultanate of Ram. Now the Sultanate of Ram, I can't hit them anymore. So I'm gonna try to stop fighting them because there's no way I can hit them. We need to uh, send somebody at the Principality of Antioch. We'll send like 25% 20, of our people. We don't really need that many men. We should be able to destroy them easily. And we'll send 50% of our people to suppress the rebellion. And we're gonna start focusing on these guys, I think. Or Kerman's good too. They have three and a half million people. Or do we wanna keep focusing on the Ibo dynasty? We only have like half a million people, but it's a lot of territories. I would like to be big. Ooh, and these guys. These guys have like no territories though. So, you know, we'll, we'll focus on... Let's focus on Kerman first. Uh, let's send a spy to Kerman. We'll take somebody out of the Sultanate of Ram and towards Kerman. We have a lot of militia, a lot of archers. So what are archers good against? Militiamen and reinforcements and forts, which we don't have that many, which is okay. And we're pretty good at arch against archers. So yeah, let's let's try to attack Kerman. And we'll send everything we have at them. And we'll send our assassins at them as well. If the guard dynasty is smart, they might choose to attack me. But I'm just gonna let them do it. I'm not gonna defend myself. I am going to just take the risk and focus on lower units cost and better taxes or something. We'll see. We'll see how smart, smart they are. Okay. Ivy Dynasty declared war on me. Interesting. Ooh, we lost again Principality of Antioch. Ah, uh, that's probably because there's not enough of them again. We have taken stuff from Empire of Nika and from Kerman. And Sultan and the Ram are now friends with me. I would ask to declare a war, but they didn't send anybody at me. Like, how do you think it's gonna work, guys? If you don't send somebody at me, how am I supposed to fight you? Now, we'll leave the, these guys alone, because we can't get them down until, uh, destroy them until they get some people, so leave them alone. Oh my god, did you? Oh, guys, we took the, over the entire Kermans, or whatever they were called. Yeah, they're gone. No traces of them ever again. We obliterated the country in a single turn. That is epicness. Give me more of my these guys and lower unit costs. Okay, Gory Dynasty. I know you're big. I know you're strong. And I know it's probably foolish to attack you right now. But I am on a roll. So let's keep rolling until we die. And we're probably going to die. Because this was a very foolish move. But I want to go. Let's go. Since the first attacks are not doing that much. Oh my god. Oh my god. What happened? We've gotten. This is the throne room. We've gotten our first achievement of being an invader. Which means we've taken a lot. So this is my throne room. Throne room. There's currently nothing here. But we can place a floor. Let's let improve my throne. Look at that. So we now have a better throne. Oh my god. Ooh. Trabzon declared war on me. We lost again. Oh, I forgot to bring my men back. Sorry. We've taken stuff of Ivy Dynasty, four of them, and stuff from Gear Dynasty. 
Oh, we killed 2,000 of them. We lost 3,000 militiamen, but we... Oh, 400 trebuchets, yes, please. We've taken four things. So what you just saw was a throne room. And the throne room is like, the more you win in the game, the better... Um, the more you can upgrade it and the prettier the room can be, which I think is really nice. And we've also got an invader achievement, by the way. So, oh, we have a million and a half rebels. That's not great. Okay, travels on baby. Why are you fighting me? Why are you fighting me? Why would you hurt me like that? I wanted to be friends. I want to be friends. I want to kill you. Yeah, I can see that. Okay, we're still gonna attacking the principi of, 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 of this, guys. I forgot to send them away last turn. We'll, we'll try to be friends. They probably won't agree, but I don't care. And I'll send those men. Wait, how many men do I have at home? And remember, I'm still not buying any infantry. I'm just getting it all from the from the research, which I'm kind of proud of. Okay, uh, Trabzon baby, you want to hit me with all that you have. So I'll send my assassins at you instead. We, we're going to raid the prince part of Antioch once we're not at war with them. And I need 30% of my people to suppress the rebellions. I don't know if that's enough. So currently we have 1.5 millions of rebels right 1.5 million 1.4 million so we're gonna see next time if it gets lower or bigger and we'll send everything else at the trap zone so again we're fighting on multiple fronts as usual we have 11,000 men or i'm just looking at the infantry taking care of our rebels which considering one and a half million rebels might not be enough but be strong man be strong 30,000 attacking trap zone 75,000 attacking the good Dynasty, another 23,000 attacking Trabzon, and 10,000 Ibu Dynasty. Well, I'm really wondering about the rebels. I feel bad for the 11,000 men who have to deal with all the rebels. I'm like, sorry. Sorry, not sorry. That kind of thing. Let's get some more assassins, because they're doing some really nice ma damage. And we should... Do we want to start focusing on new units? Because we could. Ooh, we get new units already. So we'll look at them next time. Now let's go fight. I want to know. Oh, Empire of Nika has taken my staff. I thought we were friends. Not anymore. East Barium is declaring war on me. Just like... Yeah, they just declared war on me. But we have taken Trabzon staff. Principal of Antioch keeps losing. We've taken Ibu Dynasty. We've taken Guri Dynasty. Except... So the Empire of Nika... Oh, but they took a lot of stuff. How many? Two. Oof. That's a lot of stuff. That's a lot of stuff, baby. That's lots of stuff. Okay, uh, and we've got only the rebels down like 100,000. That's a problem because I need to deal with my rebels and if I can't deal with my rebels... Okay, but we're gonna leave the rebels rebelling because I don't have time to deal with my rebels. And we'll send everything at the Empire... 75% of my people at the Empire of Nika and all of my assassins. Everybody else should be able to handle what they're fighting. But the question is, I'm getting attacked by somebody I wasn't focusing on. Who is it? East Baron. Where are you, East Baron? I don't see East Baron. Oh my god. Oh, but you have, you have no people. How are you hitting me when you have 85,000 people and 21 regions? You're big. Like, yeah, like size-wise, not people-wise. East Baron, baby. Oh, you don't have much stuff, though. Well, we're gonna be fine. Let's get this up to 99%. Let's put more stuff in taxes. We're gonna let the East Baron take whatever it wants to take. Because I can, like, decimate them. Once I decide to actually fight them. So they can have what they want to have. Also, my rebel's gonna allow be allowed to rebel. I want to destroy the Empire of Nika if I can do that. Because then... Ooh, we have achieved domination. Nice. And development. We have taken over the Empire of Nikai. We have taken two of them, so they are hopefully destroyed Trabzon. I don't go dynasty fine. Okay, and the East Barn didn't even attack me. So you guys are almost gone. Oh yeah, you guys are gone because this is the Gori Dynasty now. So Empire of Nikai. Oh, it's still here. And Trabzon. They're all still alive. But you guys wanna be friends now. Is that something I want? It's probably is something I want because I'd like to send my people at the East Baron. Okay, we'll send. But we have so many rebels. 
70% of my men go at the rebels. Ooh, okay, and we're gonna just stand at home and we're gonna pray that the East Bar and the Iba Dynasty are not gonna chew up too many of my territories. Because I just, we don't have the capacity to send our men at them. Not if I don't want to buy my infantry, which I really don't. Let's get more free units recruitment and then we're gonna start buying some of the new like marksmen and stuff like that. But not quite yet. Oh, the Guri Dynasty is friends with me now? Why? I thought we were enemies. Oh, it's okay. So I sent 64,000 to deal with my rebels, so that's helpful. Okay, let's see. Let's see. Somebody's gonna declare war on me, I'm sure. Because I'm, I'm weak. I have nobody at home. Kanim Borno Empire? Where are you? But interestingly, none of the people who I expected declare war. And, and the Kanim Borno Empire, they just said, said that they're. Oh, look at my rebels. Look at my rebels. From 1.8 million down to 100,000. Like the rebels, like, once they saw the 70,000 in front of me, like, oh, oops, 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 I'll pay my taxes, just don't kill me. I'll pay my taxes, I'll pay my taxes, leave me alone. <laughs> Ooh, good times, good times in the world of ours. Okay, East Baron, baby, I think it's time to hurt you. I'll send. 25% of my army, it should be enough to deal with you. Guri Dynasty. Now, where is the thing that just declared a war on me? Oh, you. You have 102 territories with 30,000 people. I'll send 45% of my men at you. And uh, we're going to raid this thing. Principal of Antioch, let me try to raid you. No, we shouldn't because they have no people. And raiding them when they have no people will probably not have much of an effect, will it? So let's keep attacking the Guru Dynasty. And I'll send everything else at them. So we have 24,000 infantry at the East Baron, 23,000 infantry at Trabzon, 12,000 infantry at the Empire of Nikaya, 32,000 at Kanemborno Empire, and 36,000 Guru Dynasty. Is that enough? We'll find out. I don't know. More free units recruitment, be nice. And more taxes. People, pay me money. What happens next? Kalinga declared war on me, hello. Okay, we have... Oh, Kalinga took some of my... Okay, 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 let's start from the beginning. We have taken some of East Baron stuff, more specifically two territories in good times. We have lost it again, Khan and Born Empire, and I sent a lot of people at them, so I'm quite surprised by that. Okay, so we need to send more there. We have taken... Kalinga took some of my stuff. Okay. Eh. We lost a lot against them. We're going to need to focus on Kalinga. We have taken stuff from the Gore Dynasty. Uh, the Principal of Antioch cannot beat me. Taking stuff from Trabzon and from Empire of Nikaya. Have we destroyed Trabzon? Not yet. Where is Kalinga? Because Kalinga is rough. Okay, East Baron wants to be friendly. I would like that. Let's stop fighting you. Uh, Kanem Bonem, uh, uh, Borno Empire, I'm surprised. Like, my men couldn't touch you. That's impressive. Now, where is Kalinga? Kalinga, baby, come on. If you're gonna be fight me, Kalinga, the least you could do is show yourself. Is, are you Kalinga? No, you're already in the dynasty. Where am I fighting you? Is this Kalinga? Yes. Oh, and Kalinga is 26 in units ranking. Kalinga. Kalinga is wowza. Kalinga I can beat if I focus on Kalinga exclusively. Can I get you to love me? Probably not, can I? Okay, so I'm going to need to bring some of my people home. Or just buy people. You Can I get you to love me? We're going to bring our people home. We're going to stop attacking the Kanemborno Empire. We'll just leave people at the Gorius and Empire of Naka. Now we have at home 88,000 in front of We're going to send all of our assassins at Kalinga. And we'll leave everybody else at home. We'll pour our money in the research and try to get more free recruitment. 
and we'll see. So trying to attack these guys, and hopefully, I would really like to get rid of these guys. I just want to get rid of them. Empire of Nikai, I would like to finish them off. Uh, Amir Dynasty, yeah, I'm trying to get you to love me. East Baron already loves me. And these guys, I'm not going to attack them anymore. Because I would need to focus on Kalinga. So let's see. What happens? Ibu Dynasty is starting a war. We've gotten stuff from Empire Nikaea. Prince of Atlantic keeps losing. We've taken stuff from Gear Dynasty. And we've hurt Kalinga, but we didn't kill them. And we've got almost a million of rebels again. But okay, we're gonna destroy Empire of Nikaea next turn, which is great. So I can take my men home. Gary Dynasty should be fine. Oh, Yan, Yin Dynasty, you're not fighting me, are you? No, uh, I wanna be friends. I, I want you to stop fighting me. Kanem Bo Borne, you don't wanna be friends? Seriously? Okay, okay, okay. I would dynasty. I'm not gonna fight them either. We could get marksmen and forts. I am actually thinking let's get some forts. And the reason is that forts are staying home. So if I have some forts, I'll have some sort of a defense. So I could keep fighting guys like the Ibu dynasty and not worry so much about Kalinga because I'll have some defense. Let's let's send a spy at Kalinga, by the way. We'll take somebody away from the East Baron. Oof, they have lots of stuff. Lots of stuff. So we'll send some of our people to deal with the rebels, like 25%, 30%. And we'll send all of our assassins at Kalinga again. And we'll leave the forts and the 74,000 infantry at home, and hopefully it will be enough to deal with any damage. Oh my god, there's so many wars declared on me. Sultanate of Ram, Empire of Nikia, Song Dynasty, Almohad, Almohad Caliphante is alive again. <laughs> it came back. But we have taken more of Gori Dynasty. But did we not take anything from Empire of Nikia? Oh, there was no war. So I need to send like 10% of my men at you. I need to destroy you. Principal of Antioch. Ah, uh, no. Uh, Ibu Dynasty. Let's send 25% of my men at you. That should be enough to hurt, hurt you. Who else declared a war? Gyro Dynasty. The men I have going at you are enough to kill you. But then I have, uh, uh, like, Song Dynasty. Oh, oh, you guys want to be friends. Perfect. Let's, let's be friends. Uh, Song Dynasty, baby. Tell me where you are. If you're going to fight me, the least you can do is show yourself. Is it you? This is Mongol Empire. This? Oh. Oh. Oh my god. 28 million people, 9 in the rankings? I am not ready for this. You. You. I don't want to fight you. Oof. I'm still kind of on the fence with fighting Kalinga. And then you come at me and I can't beat you. Oh, actually, uh, actually, okay. Actually, I'm the first in my army, so I probably can. But again, I can beat you if I'm fighting you alone. Well, guys, getting attacked by the strongest... This? By this? Ooh, that is rough. It's rough, 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 rough. Um... Ooh, okay. Okay, where do we have my men? Ibu Dynasty destroyed, Empire of Nisa destroyed, Gori Dynasty destroyed. And I still have 74,000 men at home. I can send them at Kalinga, but then these guys are going to take so much of my stuff. But you know what, we're going to try to negotiate them up. It's probably not going to work. And I'm going to do, a, and I'm going to buy forts. And I'm going to do a slightly silly thing. I'm going to send all of my men at Kalinga. Uh, did I send my men at Kalinga? Yes. And also all of my assassins at Kalinga. And we're going to let them hit us, the Song Dynasty, with everything they have. And then, we'll, we'll, because it's just like the first attack, I believe. 
or like the second turn so it's not that much damage and then we'll fight them back next turn and we need to put we're gonna upgrade our forts to level 55 percent 57 percent so that our forts are strong at defending against them okay let's see what happens the song dynasty thing is very worrying okay we seem to have gotten something so what do we want to get next how about a uh, second floor Ooh, nicely done what happened latina empire declared war on me seriously like calm down people we have taken stuff from empire of nikaya hopefully destroyed them Ooh, trabzon took some of my stuff we took Ibu Dynasty stuff, Guru Dynasty stuff, Kalinga stuff. The Song of Dynasty did not hurt me. Traps on it though. Okay, did I find? Okay, I finally destroyed Empire of Nikaya, which is what I wanted. Traps on, traps on, traps on, traps on. You took my thing. That does not make me happy. Oh, we're nearly done with uh, Guru Dynasty. That's good. What is this? Nothing. Okay. Oh, Song, oh my, look at that. There must have been rebels at Song Dynasty because look, at the rebels started the Pagan Kingdom instead. I don't think this was an attack because it seems like that's too many regions. I think this was like a rebellion maybe. I'm not sure. I'm not 100% sure, but that would be my guess. I mean, it could have been a, an attack, I guess. But the Song Dynasty must have fallen. They have 27 million people. I'd like to get them. And we have hurt Kalinga. Now Kalinga wants to love me now. So I'm okay with that. Because that means I can focus on the other guys. Now, who attacked me? Latin Empire. I'd really rather not fight you. Because I want to focus on the Song and, and, and on Trabzon. Okay, so we have... My, let's send more forts at home. So we can s start attacking my people. So... We have people at Guru Dynasty, Abu Dynasty, this, that's good enough. Now we need to send 25% of our people at Trabzon. And we'll send 60% of our people at Song Dynasty with all the assassins. And the rest will stay at home to defend against the Latin Empire. I don't know if that will be enough. But we'll try with 1.3 million rebels. Kalinga declared war on me again. We've taken traps on stuff, Song Dynasty stuff, Guard Dynasty stuff. I, oh, Dynasty. We've taken everything except Latin Empire took some of mine, and we have two million rebels now. Okay, so we have all of this, which is great because we have a lot less enemies now. I would Dynasty. Uh, let's try to get you up. Same for East Baron. We're gonna negotiate them up to peace. But this Latin Empire, though, that's stealing my things. Also, is Mongol Empire fighting me too now? Except that should be called like getting attacked from everywhere, including the rebels. But the Song Dynasty is getting smaller. Beating them would be great. But I need to focus on my rebels. It's just like, I need to do this, I need to do that. Who am I gonna fight, guys? But it's very exciting too. Okay, uh, let's, let's get some more boys. Uh, let's get marksmen, 15,000 of them, and we're going to send 20% of our people to suppress the rebellions, which again is not that many men, 20,000 infantry, 40,000 are attacking the Song Dynasty, that's good. Now, who else, a oh, Mongol Empire baby, you're probably not that strong, 43 in the ranking, Latin Empire is 19, and Kalinga is 37, so you need the least amount of people for me to send at you. So we're going to send 25%. Is that enough? I have no idea. And we'll keep everybody else at home to fight off the Latin Emperor and Kalinga. And we'll try to negotiate up with both of them and see if any one of them would be willing to like stop the bloodshed. I seriously doubt it because they would be stupid too. I mean, I'm weak, so attack me. They're not stupid. But it is what it is. Next turn. Next turn, next turn. Okay. I would dynasty declare a war. Who cares? <laughs> they even attacked me, but they lost. Principle of Anti lost. Kalinga took my stuff. I took Song of Dynasties and Mongol Empire stuff. 
Okay. Song of Dynasty is almost gone. But they want to start signing a peace treaty. I don't want to do that. Or do I want to do that? No, I, I oh, do I? Do I want it? Uh, I didn't really get down with the rebels either. Okay, uh, the guys fighting the Mongol Empire are doing well. I have 130,000 infantry. I need to deal with this these guys because they are hurting me. So let's send 45% and all the assassins at the Latin Empire. We need this. Now, um, Song Dynasty. Let's try to get you up. Same with Kashmir. And we'll fight. Do we want to stay at home to defend against Kalinga or do we just go with Kalinga? These guys, they probably won't hurt me. They're very weak. Actually, we could send like 10% of our army at them. Hope it will be enough. And I still have 66,000. Let's go all in at Kalinga. No. No, sorry, Gwirad. I didn't mean to hurt you. Sorry, sorry, sorry. But they're far away, so it doesn't matter. They're close enough to hit me. Let's send everything we have at Kalinga. And again, we're leaving ourselves open, but it's okay because I'm going to just buy more forts. Klinga, Klinga, baby. Where are you? Klinga! Yeah, here. 90%. Did I send all my assassins already? I think I did. Somewhere. Assassins? No. So we'll send the assassins at the Latin Empire as they seem to be the most... Oh no, I sent them already somewhere. Okay, good. Uh, the rest of my people can try to suppress rebellion, but that's going to be useless. And we'll buy more... I'll buy just some more cavalry or something. Just to sort of... We keep upgrading our forts. And uh, get more taxes. Next time. It's going to be bloody everywhere. Okay, people seem to like me now. Okay, we have taken stuff from Aibu Dynasty, from Kalinga, Mongol Empire, and Latin Empire. Guyarat hurt me. I'm sorry, Guyarat, that was my fault. I didn't mean to attack you. Almahad Caliphate just wants to stop fighting me, but I, I still don't know where they are. Also, Latin Empire wants to stop fighting me. Ha! Huh. I've taken six of their territories. You can go and cry, Latin Empire. Go cry in the corner. <laughs> That's what you get for attacking me, for declaring a war on me where I'm fighting all the other guys. Ooh, but Guyarat, you've really taken stuff from Kalinga. Oh, but Guyarat has taken my stuff, it's just a little sad, but it's fine. Mongol Empire is about to be destroyed. You know, Latin Empire just doesn't want to fight. Okay, that's going to be it for this episode. I hope you enjoyed it, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.